For those of you who are always seeking random useful Android applications to enhance your smartphone user experience, well, these six Android applications that I've curated have some useful functionalities which I believe you will love to try. Number one is Memory Guardian. Despite the convenience of the Android clipboard feature, it still poses some security threats in various forms we could think of, most importantly since it can be read by any program or application running on your device, and on Android, whenever you copy, it takes about an hour before it is cleared, you cannot tell how much information you've given out, so with this application called Memory Guardian, you can set to clear your clipboard in a certain duration after you copy any text, so if you are concerned about security, and yet you forget to manually clear anything you've copied after use, this application will take care of that for you. In the application, you can choose to instantly clear clipboard or set a specific interval for automatic clearing of the clipboard. Next is Blakeip. This application can be very useful when you have an activity going on on your phone and even though your eyes are not on the screen, turning off the screen will kill that activity. So let's say you are listening to a YouTube podcast or streaming a music video from YouTube or any platform, not always will you keep your eyes on the screen while you listen. So by just activating this application, it will bring up a pitch black screen overlay just like you've turned off the screen by yourself. It'd be pretty weird and be like, what is wrong with this guy? He's just lost his place in med school. And also... Once you install, you can easily set it up. You can change the duration of the black screen overlay. You can have even a shortcut in your notification panel so you can quickly activate it. Pretty useful. You know, sometimes you might have a wallpaper on your home screen which looks very nice, yet you wonder where you got it from. This situation makes it difficult to share it with others who request for it. That is when this application called Get Current Wallpaper comes in. With this application, you can save both the current home screen and lock screen wallpapers onto your phone storage with just one tap. You can also use this application to save some beautiful stock wallpapers from your device and even share them with others. Another useful scenario is some premium wallpaper application only allows users to set wallpapers but not save them unless you upgrade to the premium version. So as a free user of a premium wallpaper application, you can use this application to save premium wallpapers as well. It is a free and very lightweight application with no ads. Before jumping into the next application, if you've enjoyed the video up to this point, kindly consider subscribing to the channel and also like the video. Did you know that you can now replace Google Assistant on your Android smartphone with ChatGPT? Once you install this application called Voice GPT, you no longer will have to navigate to OpenAI's website to ask your questions or open the ChatGPT application to put in your prompts. With Voice Chat installed, go to the device settings and set it as your default assistant application. Once that's done, you can activate it with the same method you used to activate your Google Assistant. Now as to why someone will want to replace Google Assistant with ChatGPT, Google's Assistant delivers information that is already on the internet since it's a search engine, but the voice GPT through ChatGPT can answer a wide range of questions and even give information from a large source since it is trained on a large corpus of data and also captures human intelligence. If you didn't catch this application from one of my recent videos, then check out this next application which goes by the name Video Summarizer. It has a pretty mind-blowing function. The application summarizes long YouTube videos into short chapters to save you long hours. Most students, researchers, or people looking for insights on some topics can benefit from this application, and it works on any YouTube video of every duration. Simply copy the video link, and the application will do its analysis on the video with AI, and then give you a summary of the video. You can adjust the summary to be brief or detailed in the app settings, and it also supports almost all the popular languages. So it is a very useful tool for my learners out there, especially if you don't have time to sit and watch long videos. Whenever I have my phone screen turned off, yet I want to skip a song, I can long press on the volume up or down buttons to do that. You can also do that with the help of this application called Volume. The app allows you to control music playing on your phone without accessing the music player application. Just allow all the necessary permissions after you install. You can choose to make the app function only when the screen is off or always. With the standard version of the application, you can configure only the up or down volume buttons, but there are other actions you can perform with an upgrade. 
It works perfectly well, so you must try it out if you haven't already. Remember I talked about this application, Video Summarizer? I featured that application in a previous video which also contains some super useful Android applications which has AI built in them. So you can watch that video by clicking on the card at the end screen. Let me know down in the comments which of the applications you've loved and if you already use some of them, also comment down below. Don't forget to like and share the video and also consider subscribing to the channel. I've got more best Android applications coming up on this channel so also turn on the bell icon for that. And as always, thank you for watching.